I'm excited to play this. I just like scary games. You know? This one's supposed to be kind of spooky. And the reviews are <laughs> mostly positive. <laughs> Sleeping face. Mostly positive. Sleeping face. That was a good one. Press any button. Oh, don't push any button. Maybe that was a test. <laughs> Thank you. Monkas. Why are all you guys so scared? Hey, thanks, Barry McCockana. And thanks, Paco the Bear. Don't touch it. You have one unheard message. Two more lighthouse keepers headed First unheard message. On their arrival, they could not find Hi, baby. I'm stuck at the gate and they won't let me through. When you get back home, can you look for my ticket? I must have left them behind. Have a good look around and let me know. Love you. See you soon. That's my girlfriend. End of message. To delete this message, It looks like they were halfway through dinner. Whoa. Hootie who. <laughs> Thank you. Mm, hey, damn, thanks, Kevlar Juicy. Ten gifted? Bring in the heat, huh? Thanks. Man, I almost missed this intro. Why the hell is that thing hanging over the car? Thank you. That doesn't sound like a good way to do it. That was the intro I missed? All right, well, it's a good thing. Okay, well, I must be in my garage right now, and it's pretty dark. Right stick controls where I look, and there's a rectacle. Uh, nah. Okay, left stick walks. L1, L2's crouch. Zoom. R2 is zoom. Square. Nothing else. We got zoom and crouch. Oh, man. No prompt. Take with you. X is square. I'm taking it. Okay, now I got a light source. And it looks like it's got a good amount of lumens. It's weird that there are no prompts. What the hell is this thing? You think these things are useful? Maybe this is supposed to be a VR game. It doesn't seem like you could pick everything up. That scared me. Seven in chat if we're high as AF. Hey, thanks, Ami Boyd and Duke Jenkum. And thanks again, Kevlar. Damn, all you guys are high as AF? You can pick up all this shit, but you can't keep it. It's too bad, man. I just Maybe I shouldn't pick FBI. everything up. XE51? Stutter has scared. Huh? <laughs> Thank you. I don't like that it rotates sometimes automatically when you pick it up. That feels like a bug. Get up in there, will ya? You the best tea girl. Thanks. Uh, thanks, Duke Jankum and Super Fro. And Milk of Magnesia. This game was advertised to have Maggie toys. Uh, was advertised to have um, pad support. Is this a Caprice? It looks like it, dude. This looks like a Caprice. It is. Nice. And why the hell are you going to put wood beams over your dope-ass car? Except the <laughs> interior is <laughs> burgundy. You. Burgundy interior is for grandmas. Uh, thanks, Cryptoxor. Shit's locked. We must have to find the key. Pick the, oh, there's a door there. Maybe I could get over there. Gary stuff. Crouch. Now that's what I call gameplay. 
Man, why is everything fucking locked? Is this my house? Okay. <laughs> I'm outside. Where's the secret shit? You know I've never liked you, Rip. Still on that A1 sauce? Peach, peach, peach. Yeah, I got some, just in case of trouble. Thanks, Stay <laughs> Cold. Thank you. And thanks, Cool Yon and Cryptozor and Romeo Mio. Thanks, everybody. I've been only drinking water, though. So the A1 is only as a condiment now. But. These days only water. What the best interior on a 90 Caprice? Well, you can only get it in three colors blue, gray, and burgundy. The cop cars all had blue and gray, but the civilian ones came in blue, gray, and burgundy. So if it had burgundy, then you know it's not a cop car. And that means. It doesn't have all the Blues Brothers stuff. You know, cop suspension, cop brakes, aggressively tuned gear ratio. So, of all the colors, the one you don't want is burgundy. But, there are some rare exceptions to that rule. It's just a overall rule. Sally? <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks, Mysterioso and Duke Jenkum. One of these days, I'm going to find one of those. And when I do... Is that blood? Maybe it's just crayon. Like, you know, kids... Kids do shit with crayons. Oh. Okay, I'm in. I'm gonna close this shit. Nice ceiling fan. Man, the wind outside is so loud you can still hear it. See? Sometimes it spins by itself. Footprint. I got one of those kinds of cheese graters that they have at the Olive Garden. It's so awesome. If you're into Parmesan, trust me. You gotta grate that shit fresh. Grated cheese is trash. It loses all its luster immediately. Just ask Martha Stewart and also Julia Child. Whoa. Why did you make that creepy sound? It's trash night. Oh, oh, there's a plain text. Interesting. <laughs> I mean, what are you doing? My friend, shut up. Don't tell me how to drive. I'm pushing X. Or maybe how you just... clever our little girl is. I'm, I'm not sure exactly what's going on here, but she can already draw better than I can. She takes after her daddy. Hey, damn, thanks, man. Thanks, undesirable. Mega generous and nothing stupid to say. That's some top level airs fan level shit. Not on house way. Thanks, undesirable. Whoa. Ordered a pizza. Nice. <laughs> Thank you. I had leftover pizza. Damn. These look like some pretty well cooked wieners. Hey, thanks, dinner dilemma. Why is that a dilemma? Oh, you got parried. 
He got parried. Hold on. Let me read what you said since it's pizza related. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, what's the dilemma? <laughs> it sounds good to me. <laughs> you ordered pizza. Where's the fucking dilemma, dude? Uh, thanks very much, Undesirable. And thanks, Voye and Full Steel. Uh, root Beer or Dr. Pepper? Man, shut up. You know I liked you a lot more before the fucking question. You know that? You can't even fucking decide what kind of soda to drink. Why don't you drink water? Or Pepsi. You know Pepsi, listen, pizza and a Pepsi. That's how Mexicans say it. Pizza and a Pepsi. You gotta have them together. Trust me, they're homies. Pizza, Pepsi. <laughs> Thank you. That's, look, I don't say it like that. Why are you calling me a bigot? Uh, thanks, Jake, Zam, and Full Steel. <laughs> Lola ate a slice of that guy's pizza. What a chump. Damn, that must be his dilemma. Lol. Hey, thanks, pizza delivery guy. And thanks very much, everybody else. Hey, you guys are all right. Hmm. Let's continue. What do you think was on there? Mustard and ketchup? With the, with the wieners? How are you? <laughs> Pepsi with TV game. Hey, thanks. Uh, thanks, Duke Jenkum and Willie C. Mami. <laughs> Damn it. I couldn't hold it in. Thanks, Willie C. <laughs> uh, hanging out with you guys has made me so stupid. Mm. What? Damn, Count Chocula? You know, I've never liked you, Rip. Colon. Colon. What's in the back seat? I want to get that one. Oh, it's the same thing as the fangs. Frosted fangs. Mm, hey, thanks. Thanks very much, Mark. Zucker, these nuts. Thanks. You think there's no purpose in opening all this shit? Let's open the most important thing of all. Butt hash. Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. You should forget about buying a Hellcat and buy a Taku 8 truck. I already forgot about buying a Hellcat when I sat in one and it was like exactly the same as the fucking car I already have. Hey, what are you looking at? Is this a virtual house tour? I don't know. But there's no questions on this virtual house <laughs> tour. Thank you. Uh, uh, thanks, Willie C. And uh, Noob Killer and Forward Life and Clam Hat. I'm a I'm a boy and. Listen this up. game, right? We've got some news hot off the presses. Maybe that's me. This station has I'm Gary. reports that the two lighthouse keepers from Oxford Point Island Lighthouse have vanished. The lighthouse keepers work in three month shifts. On the shift change, two more lighthouse keepers headed out to the small island to relieve them. Upon their arrival, they could not find the men anywhere. It looks like they were halfway through dinner when yeah. something interrupted Excuse them. Excuse me. There were no signs of a struggle, and all their belongings were still there, including a journal kept by one of them. Close the, the fridge. Several times I did. The island was talking Shut up, bitch. The most common theory is that the men have suffered from cabin fever and were perhaps accidentally washed out to sea. Other cases like this have been reported Ooh. on the news, but have never been uh -huh. resolved. Ooh. The investigation has yeah. been a bizarre case. We'll update you as the story progresses. 
Listen Holy up. shit. It's a lot of the calories. Place. This station has received reports that the two lighthouse keepers. Damn, there's another kind. Or is lighthouse. it the same kind with a different the position? Work same kind. Place. On the shift change, two more lighthouse keepers headed out to the small island to relieve them. Chicken sandwich. Yo! Like About that day, dinner when something interrupted them, there were no signs of a struggle. Hey, I think the radios are repeating, there, including a journal kept by one of them. Shut up, bitch. All right, seems like I live here. Is that my dog? That's a big box. What is it? Wow. Hey, I think I'm not Gary. Maybe I'm not Gary. I'm gonna call you Sally. <laughs> okay, okay. Now it's time for your gift. Huh? You hear that? I might yell. Closing that. Pepsi is trash. Nobody gives a fuck about your shitty opinion, you moron. Mm, thanks. How do you think Pepsi's trash? You're such a dumbass. It's the same kind of guy that doesn't like Animal Crossing. Doesn't even want to have fun or like things. I don't like things. Shut up. And thanks. Uh, thanks, I have farts and diet Snapple. And Clam Hat and Kevlar Juicy, thank you again. You know, the thing is, some people, they just, they didn't get enough attention. Maybe they had too many siblings or maybe their parents were trash or something. So then what they do is they focus on having shitty opinions, you know, and then they share them. It's cool to have shitty opinions. That's cool. I have plenty. But, I mean, maybe on your stream... Maybe you could share your shitty opinions. But I don't know what makes you think anyone wants to know about your shitty opinions around here. You know? But it's no big deal. It's all good. No need to apologize. I'm doing great. Yeah, I'm stalling. So, I'm scared. Open the door. TV room. Turn this off. And found yourself stuck to what to have for dinner. Today, I've been asked to cook with ingredients you found around the house. No pancetta, okay? Are we offended? You know, I never liked you. Rick. I got an achievement. Let's see what we have here. We have uh, <laughs> minced meat. Uh, this tomato sauce. This guy's not Italian, we right? We have mushrooms. Uh, we got the bread too. This guy's hella not Italian. This guy's making that shit up. Fake well, Italian. Exactly Are we offended? <laughs> oh, look here. Almost forgot the garlic. Yeah, uh, this guy's Mexican. Okay. Today we're gonna make some kind of rolled meat. Uh, a meat log, if you will. Pom, or a room, or a do you do? Let's start the cooking up. Ours the, the fattest meat. first of his name, Lord of Pies. Lightly oil the pan. <laughs> Thank you. And set to your stove to medium heat. What did that guy say? Now. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. With the meat, uh, Cut you that throw off. it in, slap it in here. Let's go. He a Greek oh. imposter. He's Greek. <laughs> Thank you. 
If you like, you can add some salt and the spices. But they gave <laughs> me a nothing. Thank you. I'm a surprise they even gave me a saucepan. You know what? Uh, I'm not uh, cooking with this uh, packet of pasta. It can go straight <laughs> in the bin. <laughs> this guy's all right. This uh, meat's looking uh, good right now. <laughs> <laughs> Time for the sugo. The what? Is that how you say sauce in Italian, suko? And uh, some fungus. Is that how you say mushrooms? And let it simmer. Now, let's see. Ah, that's right. Uh, while it simmers, we gotta prepare our bread. What do we want is a nice pocket. He kind of talks a little bit like XQC. You notice that? And now uh, we put uh, the meat inside. A little bit. Oh, Matuwarda, I forgot the garlic. Oh, well, you get the idea. Okay, let's assemble this masterpiece of culinary delight. <laughs> what? Is he making a calzone? Hey, what are you looking at? Yes, chef. Here we have it, a <laughs> Mr. Roll. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Eat it all. I know eat it all. You eat it all. <laughs> I can't believe I made you guys watch that whole thing. All right, that was sick. <laughs> all right. Man, that's some weird effort to go through, I guess. The Exorcist 1 and 2? Damn. VHS? Oh, shit. What's in the collection? <laughs> Thank you. Behind the Black Veil 7. <laughs> Don't expect me to watch Thank it you. with you. I know you love his horror stuff, but it gives me nightmares. Ghosts? Yuck. This game already worth 60 bucks. I don't know how much it was. I think it was like 20 bucks actually, which isn't free. That's for fucking sure. Whoa! I'm pretty sure it's legal. I'm pretty sure it's legal. Cuz it's on the Twitch directory. That's a ne that's a legal nipple. <laughs> Just <laughs> FYI. My instinct was to remove it from the screen. Oh! Okay, th this seems safe. Uh, but I don't have to remove it from the screen. This is legal. Perfectly tournament viable. It was Amy. It was Amy? Who's Amy? Uh, thanks, Pill, and thanks, Tishumon, Mamma Mia, and Fondle Dongle, <laughs> Lil Thank Seizures you. Pizza. <laughs> Who's Amy? <laughs> Thanks, Herka and Desperado and Zimbombi, Blue Cupcake and Duke Jenkum and Dragon. And hey, where's my mouse? Uh, uh, Dirty Dan, Elixir, Beef Squatter, San Incense, and <laughs> Justin, <laughs> you. you bum. And <laughs> ja you. Jabikuta, Heartless Black, and D12. Thanks, everybody. Huh? <laughs> Thank you. It's safe. You can show nipples. Remember Conan? I played Conan. How come I can't remove this? Okay, good. <laughs> it's legal. And it's, it's, I don't think it, it's legal. I'm pretty sure <laughs> it's legal. You. I streamed Conan, that shit's got cooch. Cooch fangs? What cooch fangs? I didn't see no cooch fangs. 
Which one was it? The last one? No? This one? I don't see no cooch fangs. Cooch fangs? <laughs> Thank you. Read it. Read what? Oh. Oh. It doesn't say cooch fangs. It just says she has fangs where you don't expect it. You, they could be anywhere. Could be anywhere. I'm double checking for any more cooch fangs. Uh, what is this called? Amazonia. Whoa. Cool. Oops. Didn't I already see that one? How about this? Huh. All right. Man, this game's making it real easy to stall for the scares. Biohazard? Yeah, all right. I came in through that door. There's another door. Okay. Is that me? Is that me? Maybe that's me. at me oh i'm a girl i forgot i'm a girl is am i a girl wait a minute yeah right Tom, what won my first local tekken tournament thanks for all of the practical guides when did you win it like a month and a half ago or two months ago, thanks single dad doing nothing and fat goblin and why dorb. And thanks Cam X and Heartless Black and Jabikuta two years ago. No genitals. Suspicious. Globe shaped earth. Hmm. Yeah. Excuse me. <laughs> Thank you. This game's tight already. I watched Batman Returns yesterday. It was good. I, I thought it's so different than the new Batman movies. Those old Batman movies really feel like a comic. Thanks. Like you're watching a comic book. Because they're so, like... They don't care about being unbelievable. They're not trying to make it seem like it's realistic. It's like a play or something. It's really over the top. Which is cool. I like it too. Yeah, I like that too. When you start trying to make everything feel realistic, it really almost seems like you're trying too hard. You know? Change the code. Friday. Will Cox Oh, uh, it's Mike here. I got a message earlier asking about changing the code to your security door. All you need to do is enter the code, follow the steps I told you on the day I installed it. I wrote the code on the back of my business card. If you have any problem, back of my business card, isn't that over here? Is this not his business card? Dog grooming? That's not his business card. <laughs> Thank you. Yo! Max Shrek was tight. Yeah. But Michelle Pfeiffer was the ultimate. 
She was so cool in that movie. I loved how she had nine lives and he ran out of ammo. That movie was pretty cool. It was a little dry, but I really loved the Tim Burton, you know, music and Christmas. It reminded me of Nightmare Before Christmas and shit. Yeah, shut up. Maybe I should close doors and turn on lights to reduce spookiness. What was that? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. There must be another switch here. Where's the other switch? Oh, here we go. This was locked, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm looking for his business card to find the code to the thing that's next to the phone. Where's the light switch in this thing? Here. I'm going to check the downstairs first. And then we'll move up. What the hell? <laughs> Thank you. I'm glad the flashlight doesn't run out of batteries. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, is that the kitchen? It is. Okay, that's cool. We found the shortcut. Looks like I'm going up. All the doors are locked. <clears throat> mm, thanks, Pajama Slam and Miss Sue and Malazer. Thanks, Candy Cane and Duke Jenkum, Nazgoth. Hey, guys, I'm gay. P Nice, Pussy, and Zoromir. And also, uh, Screaming Harry Chun-Li and everybody else. Happy Big Friday. <laughs> Thank you. I'm gonna close this door. Can I go on the balcony? No. <laughs> Thank you. You think there will be an Italian guy again? Oh, this is the guy. 0516. Write that down. Write that down. me birth control <laughs> thank you ring the music box what do you mean ring the music box
<laughs> Thank you. Oh, you can look hey, at it. Oh, thanks. I Baby see it. Creamer, smile, smile. Oh Thanks. Oh my god, baby. It's perfect. Yes. <laughs> yes, I will. I love you, Gary. Top tier voice acting. Well, that wasn't very important, I don't think. Maybe I can find my gun. I keep it over here in the brassiere drawer. No gun? Alright. Was that open? I'm going back and doing the puzzle. Friday, Wrong device. Four, this is it, right? What was the code? This isn't a num numeric code. Oh, uh, it's Mike here. I got a message earlier Whoa. asking about changing the code to your security door. Did I just guess this what fucking puzzle? Enter the code and follow the steps I told you on the day I installed it. I wrote the code on the back of my business card. If you have any problems, call me during business hours and I'll be happy to walk you through it. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you. Did I uh, accidentally break this code? I think I did. Mm, well, I'll I'll wait. Can you believe it, Gary? It's not just the two of us anymore. Our family's growing. A twelve-hour labor totally worth it. Huh? <laughs> Love at first sight does exist, and this is the second time I've experienced it. I'm so happy, honey. You're my heart and soul. Love, Sarah. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Thank you. Is a cheese grater easy to clean? Well, you're only supposed to use dry cheese. That's the key. If you use wet cheese, then it's going to get gunked up. But if you use Parmesan or Romano shit that's dry, then you just tap it out and then leave it. And then when it dries, like the cheese moisture goes away, you like bang it real hard. All the little chunks come out and then you rinse that shit with soapy water. You're good to go. It's really easy to clean. I, I throw dishes away instead of washing them. It's totally worth it. Don't use any kind of cheese. You got to use uh, dry cheese. I'm going to go upstairs and see what else is up there. I don't know what code I'm supposed to open with that. <laughs> Thank you. The door. What door? Shut up. What is this? <laughs> Thank you. Front door? Oh, you think that's the code for the front door? I don't think it is because... <laughs> Thank you. That didn't even ask for a code. See? Look at the chart. Look to chart. Shut up. The fuck was that? Close this door. Cuddles. I must keep my gun around here somewhere. Sweet closet. Damn it! 
put me back on Amigo. Thanks, definitely not a Mexican cook. Amigo. Damn. What the fuck, dude? A bathroom with nowhere to wash your hands? Come on. That's weirdest house ever. I'm gonna flush the toilet. Nice. Oh, this is the code. Okay, hold on. Let's go in. The, huh? Let's go in here first. Ah, excuse me. Cool posters. Vampire high? <laughs> Thank you. That mean you're really high? Wow, NES? Is this legal? How did they get away with this? Doesn't seem legal. All right. <laughs> Thank you. All right, shut up. All these are locked? Weird. Okay, what is it called again? Zero five one six. Huh? Weird, it's inverted controls. Why invert this but not anything else? What? Zero five inverted? Why the fuck did you invert vertical for this? One six. Okay, I got it. Whoa. Seems like looking at stuff is one of the big things about this game. <laughs> Thank Gum. you. Based on the shitty technology, it seems like it's like, uh, it's been a while. What, what date would you guys date this game? Oh, I guess it probably says in all these things, right? Did it say anywhere? This shit's flashing, but it's not doing anything square. Take with you? Okay. I got it. I took it with me and it made a scary noise. I wonder what other things I've been able to take with me that I haven't. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hang on, what, what are you doing? What's with the mask?
That looks so fucking stupid. But everything got all Silent Hill. And I'm probably gonna yell. Oh damn, crime scene? <laughs> Thank you. Should have closed that fucking door down the hall, damn it. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. the garage it's the garage Shh. quick open velvet seven stream I know if only I had that luxury I never looked in this fridge I don't think I'm supposed to go in here, even though the door was open. Man, did my lights, lumens go down? How do you turn your light on? Maybe I turned mine off. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Thank you. It's on. The hell, dude? Car? What about the car? Oh. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Thank you. Sammy, what are you doing, my friend? Shut up. Don't tell me how to drive. Play dinosaurs. Shut up, bitch. Thanks. Uh, Fake Juan and Bastinelli, M. Holmes, Crispy Lays, Picture Point, Samsies, Eric Rameshi, Frog Uppercut, Redmond and Corp, Televator and Ashi Conten, uh, and Satanic Sushi and Lunch Bag. Sorry if I missed someone. <laughs> Thank you. It's break time? Good. What the hell? Thank you. I beat the game? What the hell? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that was my car earlier with the cop. I'm stuck at the gate. Yeah, you will see you soon. Whoa. Find a way to vanquish the spirit. 
I thought I beat the game. All right, let me uh, let me take a break. Yeah. Excuse me. Mm. So for taking breaks with headphones, first I have to take them out, and then I won't be able to hear you anymore. I can't hear you. So uh, I'm gonna mute the game audio now. So now it's <laughs> muted. Thank you. And then I'm going to thank Tom Bombadilla and Dark Bravado, TK Baja, Ground Control, and uh, Bombadilla. Did I thank you already? All right, all right. Uh, thanks very much, first of all. Furthermore, let me take this damn break, five to seven. Then I'll come back and I'll get, I'll stall some more. Because it's scary, you know? Tell me when the music starts. Did it start? All right, be cool. Poof, nice break. Man, I was even stalling on the break. These kinds of games are too scary. Thanks, Magnificent 7. And thanks, My Organs Are Cats and CEZ, Lord 7 and Diddy Dong, Lord Ayaya and Tom Bombadilla. Thanks, guys. Okay, I'm ready. I got my, mm, you know, headphones in. I'm doing great. A little bit spooked, but that's my own doing. <clears throat> so I beat the first playthrough, and now this is New Game Plus. And I start off in the derelict mansion. So the mansion changes. could yell shit stains spooky Yo! Ah. stop wasting time and play super caesar's palace on snes casino time bytch i've decided not to yell at you but i'd like you to go fuck yourself in hell for saying that while I'm enjoying myself. Uh, you know, I think I won't try that. In fact, I think I won't even play SNES again. Uh, thanks, whatever your dumb fucking name is. I do appreciate the gesture, <laughs> but I don't appreciate the message. Uh, anyway, thanks Computer Hooft and Yolo Meister and everybody else. I'm trying to have fun over here, man. <laughs> and you're over here you. demanding shit? That's exactly why I'm not going to play that game. <laughs> Thank you. That guy was an asshole. And whatever happens to him as a result of that message and the mood he put me in with it, I mean, I can't be held responsible for it. You can hardly even call that a hex. Anyway, thanks again. Uh, thanks, Bokomog and Lang Kush. Thanks very much. Hey, that's a. Isn't that like um, PT? I might yell. Thanks. You're my favorite streamer smile. Hey, thanks very much. That's nice of you to say. Thanks, uh, smack pack, snack pack. I always prefer jello pudding to snack pack, personally. 
And the reason is because snack pack doesn't hey, need to be refrigerated. Can't shoot me, I'm already dead. Anyways, you're my favorite streamer, smile. Shut up, bitch, if you're that last guy. Anyway, thanks. I can shoot you easily. I can report you and say you said the N-word, which you practically did. And uh, then they'll take me seriously because they trust me. And uh, you'd be out of here, you know? And you'd also better hope that your Twitch name isn't linked to my chat. Because, uh, you know, then there's more I could do. Anyway, no big deal, dude. I don't want to talk to you again, though, so why don't you go watch the main man? Mierda! Dunkaroos are the best. Dunkaroos? I think I've had those. They're alright. But Snack Pack is pudding, dude. What does it have to do with Dunkaroos? Dunkaroos is like frosting. I mean, they're good, but what do they have to do with it? It's not even the same. <laughs> Thank you. What? Same shit? You're an idiot if you think that. Snack Pack is like Jello pudding. Dunkaroos are like those... Uh, what were those things called where it had cheese on one side and you'd peel it and then take the crapper and cracker and scoop it in the cheese? Not Dunkaroos. Dipsticks? Uh, I don't remember. Whatever they were called. Uh, shut up. Thanks. Uh, thanks very much. Pop Dart. Thanks, big old Keith and Simo Halo and Redmond. Thanks very much, Littlefoot and Boko Mog and everyone else. Thanks for liking my stream. Oh? Oh. Whoa. Okay. I'm gonna go this way instead. Thanks. You're my favorite Harry Potter character, Microbe. Home or at the room or at the room. Kage! Me Thanks. and Dad are gonna fook that guy up. Fook? Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Damien and Moneybag Joe and Big Old Keith. Thanks. Best Kool Aid flavor? Believe it or not, you may not believe this. But I've never had Kool-Aid that's made with a powder. I've only had the Kool-Aid bangers. You know, those squeeze it. And I don't remember it. But I've never had Kool-Aid <laughs> from the powder. Thank you. My mom didn't like that shit, man. She always got juice. She didn't let any kind of powdered shit in the house or concentrate. Nah. She wasn't into it. My mom didn't like it. My mom also never let us have a microwave. So I never even had a microwave when I was growing up because she didn't like microwaves. Uh, and like when I was like 25, I finally figured out how to use a microwave after burning my fucking mouth <laughs> off. I thought it was like a Thank toaster you. oven. And you know, you can't put something in the microwave for five minutes. <laughs> it shit becomes nuclear. Yo! <laughs> Enjoy the game and scared pussy. Uh, thanks, Sam Seas <laughs> and Jaeger Thank Bombs. And thanks, uh, Chosen One Dre gifted 10 subs and subscribed. Thanks, Duke Jankum. Thanks, everybody. Sorry if I missed your name. Uh, but, you know, whatever. Man, there's some decent stuff to look at. Collectibles. All right. Charlotte Mars. Spooky game. You think the Italian guy's on? I guess not. <sighs> Lucky stars. <laughs> Lucky stars. Hey, 
Didn't I accidentally open this before? I don't remember how. I didn't look in it, remember? I thought I did something like skipping. <laughs> Thank you. Damn, bring in the heat. Thanks, Schlichter. I don't know if I like that name. Thanks, Schlichter. All right. You know what's good is when you put your own fresh pepperonis on a frozen pepperoni pizza. Really, any kind of toppings work. I haven't done that in many years, but I used to do that. Whoa. When I was, like, younger, I used to do that all the time. Read the name on the pizza? Papa's? Shut up. Sarah managed to make a call to 911 before she succumbed to her injuries. The primary suspect of this brutal murder is believed to be her husband, Gary Pout. He was found deceased only mere blocks away, slumped over the steering wheel of his car after a fatal collision with a tree. The murder weapon was found in the car with him, leading investigators to speculate that he crashed his car while fleeing the scene of the crime. The couple had a daughter believed to be 19 years of age, but police have been unsuccessful in tracking her down. If anyone knows the location... What? Please contact Pleasant Falls PD immediately. It is also believed that there is a victim to domestic abuse. If you or someone you Would know... Would you shut up? Domestic abuse. Talking shit about me? I think I'm that guy. Hey, look at the neighbor's houses. What the hell? This might, must be like a nightmare. June 6, 1999. My head. <laughs> yeah, right. Thank you. Oh. 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 <laughs> you want to go? Let's do this. Open the door. Pussy. Hey, what happened to my light? Ah! Ah! What the hell? Ah! Hey, this game's too scary. It's too scary. I don't want to play it. <laughs> it's too scary. Mm. Yeah, whatever. I'm not scared. Open the dumb door. What the fuck was that? Ah! You're my favorite screamer smile. Hey, thanks, 
very much. Did I already thank everyone? Because I should really do that. <laughs> thanks, Ayaya. And uh, hold on. Uh, thanks, Protection and uh, Jaeger Bombs and Samsies. You know, I think I should start double thanking. Hey, uh, why didn't it show all the gifted subs there? Someone gifted all these subs and it, it's not here. I think uh, there are issues. I think it was that Schlichter guy. Uh, I think that this thing is having issues. I'm going to talk about them a little bit longer. Eh, yeah, it seems like they're having some kind of issues, you know? Mm. Okay. <laughs> Thank Thanks, you. Sauda94. What are you looking at? Quit Stalin, pussy. Smash, shut up. Use this as a weapon? What the hell? That door is open in the reflection. <laughs> Thank you. Mirror. I got a mirror achievement. Whoa. The room's inver inverted, and so are the graffitis. Man, I ain't going down there, hell no. Oh. All right, fine, I will. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Look, there's a secret area. I gotta make a right turn, I guess. <clears throat> what? How the fuck do I get to the other side of the road? It's just the decoration. Man, this music is intense. I might yell. You can't go in the mirror again. There must be some secret. What's your favorite pizza chain, round table? I don't order anything else <laughs> these days. Thank you. But that's because everyone's always so generous and donates money to me. So, you know, I mean, what else am I gonna do? Order big dinner. 
Papa John sucks. For delivery, I think the worst delivery is... I mean, okay, so bottom tier, 7-Eleven, and basically tied with Caesars, Lil' Seizures, that's like the worst. 7-Eleven and Lil' Seizures. Thank you. Then after that, Papa John's and Pizza Hut. Those are tied. They suck. Garbage. Uh, I mean, what are you little bit better than that, Domino's. Thanks for the laps, amigo makes for a good birthday. Happy birthday, man. Alfard Hydra. Happy birthday and thanks. Uh, anyway. Pizza Hut and Papa John's tied. Little bit better than that, Domino's. Specifically Thin Crust. But all the shit that I just mentioned, I won't eat. <laughs> so just to make that clear, I'm just as likely to eat any of the things that I just mentioned as I, like, I, zero, no eating, does not go in here. So take that, you know, that's my tier list, but I won't eat any of those. Uh, maybe Domino's if it's free. Like if someone gets it and it's like someone's getting Domino's and you're, they're like, you want anything? And you're like, nah, but you know, don't get onions. <laughs> Yeah, all right, but uh, not. I won't be ordering it. Nah, nah. Hmm. You know. Hey, thanks, Alfard. Uh, happy birthday again. And tightrope and foxhound and Zomai Valdezzi. Thanks for the tier three, man. The Basie finest, Indiana Jobless, and Worm Sub Zero. Thanks, everybody. I don't know how to get out of this place. Oh shit! Did you see that? Uh, that's not enough. You have to move it more. Oh, <laughs> nice. You. Okay. Woo. Stabbing weapon? Man, these don't seem like weapons. What do you think this is, kimchi? Had artichokes and broccoli on a pizza today, it was hella good. <laughs> I saw it on Thank Twitter. You. That shit sound that shit looked weird as fuck, dude. It had like pepperoncinis and artichoke hearts and broccoli. But I thought to myself, my instinct was that this shit looks whack, but I'd eat it. I wouldn't order it, but I'd eat it. Quit stalling, bitch. Someone shoot that guy and make him feel it. I think I should go check this room right here and see if I missed anything. Hmm. I don't know. Oh wow, look at that! You can move these boxes! What makes onions bad flavor or texture? Texture, of course. Flavor is amazing. I don't mind the texture if it's masked by something like chips. For example, if you have chunky salsa and you're eating chips and salsa, the chip crunch masks the chunky salsa crunch. But if it's soft, <laughs> like in a burrito, bean burrito, or like enchiladas, Onions really stand out. I hate that crunch out of nowhere or you know like anything that's soft that has crunchy onions in it It doesn't work even like a burger. I, it's got to be grilled really really well Well done so that it's smooth and finely diced like in and out or somewhere like that. I Like onions. They're essential for flavor. I love the flavor of them, but I need the I need the uh, crunch to work with the meal uh, thanks Clyde and Duke <laughs> Jankum and Tingu and thanks again Sean and hamburger fries. I'd eat I'd eat it. I wouldn't order it, but I'd eat it. Damn is this one? Ah! Man, am I uh am I crazy?
Should I put my wiener in there? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, all right. You guys need to figure out what that shit meant. Oh. Oh! Hey, buddy, can you come over here and help me out? <laughs> Thank you. Is my flashlight not even working, dude? Man, whatever. I'm not even scared of that guy. Hey, what's up? Ah. Ah, oh, fuck. Man, I can't see shit! You know what people do when <laughs> when you. people ask, "Hey, when is Eris gonna play this game?" or "Do you guys know when Eris is streaming?" They'll link a clip, <laughs> and Thank it you. will be titled "The Schedule," and it's just a clip of me yelling like that. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's really funny. Hmm. Hmm. Pretty good. Uh, thanks, uh, Jenkins. In her home. Stabbed over ten managed to make a and thanks, Dunya and Deadly Shoe Toy and Keo Senpai and Mappa and Ultra Instinct. Thanks, hamburgers and fries and everybody else. Ugh. I don't do that. Other people do that. It worked on me. That's why I thought it was funny. I love bits. Like, I clicked it, and I was like, what clip is this going to be where I talk about the schedule? <laughs> and that shit just like, ah! <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. You got me. Damn, that was a lot of buildup because it was so dark. Man, darkness. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Grego the Thigh God and Scooby-Doo Dave and Anatech. Undesirable. Thanks again for all the generosity. Whew. All right, let's try again. That was pretty good. I have already beaten the game twice. Just like a karate dummy. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, shit. Did she fart? My doors are different color. You'll be down here soon. That's the bathroom. It's just too scary, man. <laughs> Thank you.
I mean, there's nothing you can do but get scared. You have to get scared to win. Because it's a scary game. And if you're not scared, then you wasted 20 bucks. You know? So, I have to get scared. Damn it. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks. Thanks very much, Real Real Modulus and Goji, Grego, and North Cat. Thanks. <laughs> hey, wasn't there Thank a door you. there before? Wasn't there a bathroom there? Oh. First of June, 1990. I asked him today what he does down there. Yeah, whatever. Hide? Hide? It said, ah! Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Am I hiding from something? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, flashlight off? Oh, shit. That was the unhide button. Rehide. I don't know how to turn the flashlight off. I don't think you could turn it off. straight my shit's getting distort distorted ah! damn it what the fuck dude this game sucks did i win or lose or what there was no way to escape Next caller. Spooking on Tameos. Hey, thanks, Duke. Duke, uh, mm, Jenkum. And thanks, uh, Elk Hater and Ruthless K and Lumps Razor. Uh. Ah! Is this the same stage again? Oh, I died. I didn't win. Okay. It's the same stage. So, all I gotta do is go here then look at this brazier drawer and then... Hey, wait a minute. Look at that. Get up in there, will ya? Come back to me, Aris. Hey, thanks. Hey, what's going on here? First of June, 1990. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Now, this is when we initiate... What didn't it initiate? It didn't initiate... Uh, thanks, Tifa's milkers. <laughs> Thank you. Hide.
What gives? That distortion shit isn't happening. The shit on your screen means she's close? What do you mean the shit on your screen? You mean on the walls? I didn't flush the toilet. Jizzy door. Maybe that's where the spider is. Ah. Yeah, this game's fucking super scary. There's nothing else to it. Ah! What the fuck was that? Oh, it was the reflection of my flashlight. It's very scary. But hash. Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. The poop in my pants means she's close. Hey, thanks, Ghost of Davidion and Doc, uh, J.R. Daco. Uh... Does that noise mean she's close? <laughs> Thank you. Ah! What should I do? Close the door. Holy shit! Close that door too! Ah! What am I supposed to do? Turn the light off? Ah, I don't know how to do that. I pushed every button already. That's kimchi. And you're a bigot. It's too bad, man. I just This game's too scary. Yesterday. I'm coming for you. Man. Uh, no offense, Alien, but compared to this game, come on, man. You're a kid's game. Oh! Oh, fuck. Got a Top job speed? today. And Red Curry walk for dinner. Thanks. I hope that's Shepard's pot. <laughs> Thank you. Excuse me. Uh, thanks, job, job getting scared bitch, <laughs> yeah, and thanks, thank alien and o OT Industries, uh, hamburgers and fries, be still and Revelia. Thanks, everybody. Happy big uh, Friday, man. This lady's camping the front door. Quit camping the door, you camping ass bitch!
It's really scary, but that's kind of all it's got going for it right now. Ah! Ah, fuck this game! Damn it, scares the shit out of you for no reason. It's too scary. I guess it's not just too scary. It's also too scary and it feels like you can't win. It's like just for the sake of getting scared. You know? I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> but you. I'd be willing to play it if it felt like there was something to solve or... I don't know, an inventory. I don't have to be able to fight. But at least, you know... Damn, I'm a bussy? Alright, fine. I'll keep playing it for a while. Because you guys called me a pussy. Uh, thanks, Corn Strike. In fact, I think I'll beat it. Mm. Let's continue. Psh, I'm not even scared. It's not even scary. See, look. She went in here? Yeah, whatever. Nice toilet. You know? Okay, now. Instead of going that way, we'll just go straight downstairs. See what I mean? The trick is... Whoa. Gun con? That's a gun con. Isn't it? I'm not gonna read all this shit, but... There was a gun con 1, 2, and 3. Maybe more, but I had a 1 and then a 3. And the gun con 3 had a pedal and it had uh, feedback, like recoil. And the original, it had no recoil and no pedal. Please try earthbound. Look, dude, I don't like fucking requests. They're right there next to questions. I also don't like people begging. The garage is open, but... Alright, I'll go this way. Fine. Ah! <laughs> Thank you. Is that shit behind me? I'm not the one with problems. I just need to numb the pain. It's the only thing I can do to not feel. Ah! Take with you. Maybe that's my weapon. That's all I needed all along. <sighs> what? Hey, did you guys read that? Damn, why's it got jizz stains on it? But hash, Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. Cool.
Maybe I should take pictures of other stuff just in case. Spokesperson from the CADV or Citizens Against Domestic Violence had mentioned during a press statement that it's easy to turn a blind eye to domestic violence by explaining away the problem. Often in cases like these, the victim is in love with their assailant. As we all know, love often has a These cases often need outside intervention, but ultimately, it is up to them to help themselves. Usually, the assailant in these situations will suffer from addiction and sometimes deeper psychological problems. If you or someone you know is involved in a situation like this, please contact our anonymous helpline for guidance. In other news, the annual Orange Claw Festival... Who the fuck are you? All you do is drink. You're a monster. I can't live like this anymore. Open the fucking door. Maybe I have to take a picture of it. Hey, thanks very much. Uh, it's Pandy and Cornstrike and Harry Bussy fucker and Sister Susie's Harry Bussy. <laughs> Idiots. <laughs> Cellos. Break time? Don't have to tell me twice. Man, I'm glad you guys convinced me to not flush this game. I was thinking about it, but when you guys told me I was a bussy, that really motivated me to hang in there. And now we're in it for the long haul. Nice. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, thanks, Cotty. And thanks again, Sister Susie's Harry Bussy. I'm going to take a break. <laughs> Uh, five to seven minutes, will ya? And uh, and then I'll continue. I like the camera mechanic. Oh wait, I gotta take out my head crones. Yeah, I think I'm gonna play. I don't know when, but I'll play that fish game again. I was gonna play uh, Streets of Rage, but I forgot it existed. No big deal. Anyway, I put away my head crumbs now, so tell me when the music starts. Oh, wait! The music started already, didn't it? Yeah. Excuse me. Okay, well, wait. Redo. Okay, be cool. Poof. I had a snack. Man, I felt like all this adrenaline is draining my streaming energy. So I had to have a little snack roo. Mm, thanks, Lord Doink. Whew, my heart's still kind of not working right. Mm, thanks, Roads to Rome and Slam Shark. Uh, thanks for, excuse me, thanks for gifting 10 subs. That's a cool Michael Jackson emote. <clears throat> Stupid spooky game. 
Mm, I had a, like one of those organic strawberry bars. Uh, do you remember what I was doing? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I remember. I got a camera and this hallway just appeared. It's my hallway. Yeah, sure. <sighs> this looks like a loony bin. Hey, take with you. Did you see that? It said something about that. Shoot suspicious stuff with your camera? Well, everything's fucking sus- Whoa. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, the camera's infinite out. <laughs> Thank Mo. you. Mo. 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 I got a achievement. blood coming into this room or was that a different room oh ah! take a picture of this fucking asshole Wow! Fucking Kazuya Stomp! What the hell? <laughs> what? What are you looking at? Hey, thanks. Thanks, Haywood Jablomi. And thanks, Bong Shrapnel and Big Wig, Miss PH, and Edward Tentacles. 
thanks, uh, Lord Doink. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks, Cake or Zero, for the Twitch Prime. <sighs> the Jizzy Door. Maybe I gotta take a picture of the Jizzy Door. <laughs> Thank you. Looks Jizzy. Uh oh. Doesn't look spooky. There's nothing here. This is the vehicle's top speed, right? For a second, I thought there was a run. There is no run. No, I never decoded this thing again. Square? Maybe you don't have to decode it. Oh, you pick. Oh, it's a Rolodex. I thought I accidentally unlocked it. That's pretty cool. Advanced technology. Maybe I can call people. Order some pizza? That sounds like a great idea. Looks cool. You know, I've never liked you, Rip. Hey, thanks. Thanks, Amanda Hug and Kiss. What's the problem? He goes, Amanda hug and kiss, and he says, uh, Amanda hug and kiss, can I get Amanda hug and kiss? And he goes, why can't I find Amanda hug and kiss? And Barney goes, maybe your standards are too high. And then everyone laughs their fucking asses off. It's really good. <laughs> Thank you. It's good. It's a classic. <clears throat> Is this guy gonna come in here and kill me or what? Thanks, Bold Brain and Caius. I mean, the music started playing. I thought I should hide. Butterscotch pudding, it's good. It's 
weird. It's way less scary when you can see her. <laughs> it looks super stupid when you can see her. But when you can't see her, it's really scary. I've played games like that before. That's actually pretty common in the homemade horror genre. Man, what are you supposed to do? This bitch fucking camps you all day. Man, my heart's pounding. Damn, I thought she was gone. She's not gone. You think she's gone? I don't even fucking know, man. I'm dead. Ah! Man, that's fucking cold blooded, dude. The camera doesn't. I mean, dude, the camera doesn't pause the action? That's fucking stupid. <laughs> Fuck. That's cheap. Butt hash. Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. Love the Armenian throat music. <laughs> That's my wrestling move. Like Shawn Michaels, kind of. Thanks, Bold Brain and Cheetos. Hey, this place looks different. Maybe this is like... Ah! Maybe this is like back in time. You know? You ever think of that? Grab the pills? Mm. Nah. That's cheap. So I could be attacked by that bird at any moment. What the hell? You know I've never liked you, Rip. Hey, thanks, Howie, whatever, and Stoic, and Cheetos too spicy. Thanks very much. I can see in the real IRL? Yeah. The hell is this? Take with you. Oh, remains? I think I won. That's weird, right? It feels like you die when you win in this game. 
That's how you beat the stage. That's what I meant. Like, you keep, like, getting scared. Just like there's no way to avoid it. Even when you win, you gotta get scared. All you do is drink. I need you. And I love you more than I can express. I don't understand how you can. scares me. You scream louder than her? Well, that's because she's more afraid of me than I am of her. And that's because I'm screaming louder than her. Anyway, shut the fuck up. Uh, thanks, Origin, JM, and Superfly, and Stoic. What do you mean you didn't win? This is a new stage. I did win. See? New objective. I won. That's how you win in this game. You get scared, and you do the objective. Usually doing the objective scares you. I like the camera though. It makes for some interesting, you know, stuff. You call that losing? I'm surprised. I figured you would know the concept so well. But perhaps you're so familiar with it that you just think everything is losing at this point. It's hard to tell. The only way to figure it out is to get to know you better, and Lord knows I don't want to do that. Hey, keep that baby quiet. Smile, smile. Ah! What the hell? Ah! Oh shit! Come on, man! Thanks, Harry. Balls in my mouth. And thanks, Origin. I should run? You can't run in this game. Shows what you know. Noob. Find the rest of the photo. Man, I'm grinding my teeth. I'm grinding. Uh, thanks. A uh, little... Whatever your stupid name is. Big Dick. And thanks, Deep Web. <laughs> Thank you. You guys still recommend that I play uh, sleep, Streets of Rage? He was out with Maggie getting ice cream or something. I, I don't know. I was asleep. Look, my baby boy just died. And I don't know how. What kind of God would kill an innocent baby? I didn't kill my son. Yes, I have postnatal depression. 
confession, but I'm telling you. I woke up in the night and had a strange feeling something was wrong. And I ran to his room and I found his crib pillow. His lifeless body. His little hopes on the sun. My baby boy. Cake with you? Oh, plain text. So that's why I killed her. The the plot thickens. <laughs> Thank you. What a plot? Shut up, man. Obviously, the only reason I'm playing this game is because it's scary and out of spite. Because you guys are being little <laughs> bitches. Thank you. And I'm enjoying it. Hey, what up, girl? Damn, let me get one of those. Can't get one of those? An investigation has begun into the tragic My death of a six month old baby. Two people story. talking at the same time, huh? I their six year old daughter buying so. groceries. When they returned home, I they guess. found the mother of the child holding the infant in her arms. Authorities have taken the mother in for questioning, but what she has since been released. A spokesperson for Pleasant Falls to the told us that the death has been ruled accidental. Just However, the investigation is ongoing. It's believed that faulty nursery chanting. equipment may have failed causing this tragedy. Infocare had issued a full recall on all their bassinets in accordance with the <laughs> investigation. Our best wishes and condolences go out to the family involved in this tragedy. He had no clothes on whatsoever. around and looked right at me. Honestly, it kind of scared the shit out of me, but I guess that's what I get from being so damn nosy. I couldn't tell what he was chanting though. It kind of sounded like it could have been in another language, but I'm not really sure. The whole thing just made me feel so uneasy. Like, it feels like my core. I just assumed he was sleepwalking. Do you think there would be a bit more to it than that? This game's spooky. You guys love it now, or are you still hating on it? I think it's pretty cool. I mean, it's cooler than it was before I got the camera. <clears throat> you guys love it? That's weird. For some reason, I don't believe you. I think you're just trying to get me to stop playing it because you think that I can't tell when you're full of shit. You hate it. And I love it. Don't forget that. was out with their six-year-old daughter buying groceries. When they returned home, they found the mother of the child holding the infant in her arms. Hey, didn't I get a card? I think I got a card. Maybe I gotta use it on like one of these scanners. Nice. Uh -oh. Nice. Hmm. Whoa. I probably have to take a picture of this because it's one of those uh, lineups. The usual suspects. Good. You can't run in this game, you moron. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's a part of the painting. Oh. I 
can't take a picture. I already tried that. My camera will come out of my pocket. Grinding my Thank team. You. This game's pretty scary. How do you turn on your light? Can you even do that, or did I make that up? This is ridiculous. I'm going back in here. You can't see shit. God, you guys are bitches, you know that? <laughs> Thank you. Any hey, gift me a sub? Someone give that guy a million seconds right now. No panhandling in here, bitch. Gift me a sub. Fuck you. Man, why'd they make this shit so dark? <laughs> Are you Thank trying to you. scare me? Should I hide? <sighs> ha! Square, square, square. Does that mean she's in here?
<laughs> What's that about? Why'd she step on your face like that? Man, this game is too scary for what it's worth, I think. I'm gonna have a heart attack. <sighs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There is no more chef. I passed that level. Hey, thanks, Eric's Techniques and Ascapade. <sighs> Man, I have to take a breath. This really, it's really scary. <laughs> Oh, you. <laughs> Academy Award winning performance <coughs> arts. Excuse me. Thanks, Grave Lord Morrow. And Dread Alert. And DK Romo. Uh, thanks, Kern Craft. And Takatama. Mm, Easy LP Strong Beans. Air of the. Air. Excuse me. Mm, air of nothing in particular. Nice shitty name. Thanks very much. Uh, little Nick's big <laughs> dick. Hold Thank up you. and thanks. And J T Kester. Thanks very much. Mm. Yeah, I just gotta take a moment, man. That game, this game is scary, and it it gets my uh, you know I don't know what happens, but I get scared. It doesn't feel comfortable. It makes me feel like a uh, wobbly, you know. <laughs> Thank I feel you. a little wobbly when I get that scared. Get some A one. I got some. I got some. Oh, nice honky train. Thanks, guys. Mm, appreciate it. Thanks, Skivier, and El Señor Presidente. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks very much. Thanks, all Al Not for the Twitch Prime. Maybe you guys should like uh, talk to me about what you're excited about, and that'll bring <laughs> my uh, jitters down. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Chubster and DJ Master Funky Fresh. Yeah, it's a scary game, man. It's really scary. You can't even fucking see, like, five steps in front of you. And you don't even really know what the fucking rules are, you know? At least Alien was like, okay, I know what the rules are. It doesn't like fire. There's an alien-sized vent over here with jizz <laughs> dripping out Thank of it. You. I get it. This game is homemade, man. They can do whatever the fuck they want. It's just scary. You. Uh, you know? Thanks, Sexy and Death Dealer. A new movie to watch? Check out Whiplash. Hey, chat room, what do you think? This orange name says I should watch Whiplash. <laughs> Thank you. Damn, thanks, Mason. Thanks for the five gifted. Yeah? Wow, most people say, it, say it's good. I'll Google it. Is it new? Maybe it's new. Where's my damn mouse? Twenty fourteen? <laughs> Thank That's not new. Thank it's like you. six years ago. I never heard of this movie. Music film. What do you guys think? Worth it? You know what else I still haven't watched? The Ferrari versus Ford. Those are two movies I have not watched. Butter <laughs> Thank you. Butter Sheesh. Everybody, get down. <laughs> Thank Thanks you. very much, Juan. Hey, Juan, you like Whiplash? Thanks for gifting a big hundo <laughs> and a big Thank hundo. You. Thanks, Juan. Bunch of you are Eris subs now. 
Mm, thanks, Attila. And thanks, Gravy. And Nero. And Stoic Rhino. Stoic Rhino. And thanks, Mason. <laughs> Thank you. And mega thanks, Juan and Anonymous. Mega thanks. Yeah, that made it a level five. I didn't know one person could conduct a level five. Is that the biggest one I've ever seen? I think it is. Leave it to Juan. Mm. Thanks. Level five honky train. Thanks, Kritsky. Kritsky. <laughs> Thank and you. Stewie underscore. Five is the max? Sweet. So we, does that mean we won't get hype trains anymore? Hope so. Mm, I only like honky trains. Mm, I love honky trains. And channel points. All right, you want to try one more time? Uh, this game's super scary. It's a new stage. Any gifters? Someone shoot that guy hard. F5, the finger of God. Hey, thanks, Ju Duke Jankum. Duke Dankum. Thanks, guys. Mm. Yeah, there's no panhandling in here. I hate that shit. Because the fucked up thing is... Someone will probably give that shit to you. Because Eris fans, not only are they generous, but they're a little dim. You know? So, you're just gonna like... It's like uh, being a predator on the elderly. They're so stoned and generous, man. So, fuck you. No panhandling, bitch. You gotta farm that shit like a man, like everybody else. Leave a tab open and eventually you'll get hooked up. But no begging. Pathetic. And also no questions. That's a number one rule around here. Well, what the hell do you suggest I do now? Now that I'm hearing this spooky shit. Am I supposed to just get scared and then die? Because I've been doing that the whole time. Butt hash. Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. Best joke gets a sub go. Nah. I don't like that idea because now I have to ban you. Mm, hey, Ghost of Davidion, would you shut the fuck up, dude? That would be really good one of these days. I don't know if you will, but it'd be good. This guy's always saying the dumbest shit I've ever heard, and he's like one of the most generous, annoying motherfuckers I've ever seen. How could you have such high levels of both? <laughs> Thank you. It's shocking. Some people just don't give up when it comes to not being funny, and that I admire. Perseverance. Is that the word? Maybe that's not the word. Whatever it is, I'm a little scared right now. So, you should take everything I'm saying with a grain of salt, because, you know, maybe I'm not thinking straight. But, shut up, bitch! Cut that bitch off! Nicole. Where else am I going to steal jokes for my act? Yeah, but you don't have to say that. That's the key. You see, the thing that makes it obnoxious is you don't have to fucking say that. You can just not say anything. You know? You ever think about that? 
You might want to think about that. No saying things. Think about that. No saying stuff. You know, I think if you take that advice, your whole life will turn around. I guarantee people will like you more. I promise. All right, anyway, let me pay attention. Thanks, Ghost of Davidion and Alucinor. And th hey, thanks, Duke Jenkum, and uh, big thanks again, Juan and Anonymous. <laughs> Thank you. I don't think I've been in this bathroom. Man, how many bathrooms does this place have? Cut that bitch off! Aris wins. Ah! What the fuck made that noise? <laughs> Thank you. Did I just turn the water on more? Turn the fucking water off. Sammy, what are you doing, my friend? Shut up. Don't tell me how to drive. No abla in glass. Hey, thanks, Eastside Eli and Extremes. And thanks, Ghost of Davidion and Moochie Licious. Hope everyone's having a great day. Sammy, what are you doing? My like friend, me. Up. Don't tell me how to drive. You're my favorite seven smile. Chat him selling my gifted subs for 20% off. Hit me up. I think it got glitched out because I took a picture of him when I got scared. I bugged it out. I got scared and then I took a picture of him and the cutscene broke and then my. I don't know what happened. Pretty sure that's what happened. Because I didn't see him pull the thing out of my chest. Okay, I didn't pass that mission. I failed it. Ah. Uh, thanks, very banned. Wrong way. I think we gotta go downstairs. Hey, what are you looking at? Why does the hysterical purpose recreate the mind? Hmm. Nice question. Where's that one with titties? One of these movies had exposed, uh, you know what? I need to find it. Whoa! Maybe this one? I don't see shit. Whoa! Alright, that's decent. But we gotta get that dude out of there. Maybe we should leave him in because I know there's a lot of gay heiress fans. Hook you guys up. Hey, I couldn't dodge my sub ATP feels beard man. Get good, noob. Thanks. Noob, thanks Volcor and Second Sex Proposed Har Harmony or whatever. Hide? You can hide under that?
Cut that bitch out! Let's go! Doink. Hey, thanks. Yeah. Excuse me. Remember I picked up, like, some kind of film? Thanks, Obamacare. What's up, man? Hope everyone's feeling good. I'm having a pretty damn good one myself. I'm looking forward to playing that fish game again. I wanted to try this out first, just to mix it up. Keep it fresh. the Italian guys on yeah I like that fish game Evo that game was great read the wall oh. thanks look that was a shitty piece of advice you gave me why am I reading this wall this wall sucks might as well say Beavis sucks <laughs> Man, who wrote Beavis sucks all over the place? How many people are writing this shit? <laughs> Beavis sucks. Man, all these ghosts need to shut the fuck up. They always make all this noise. Why don't you hurry up and scare me then? Coast is clear. That's a good hiding spot. You don't like it? Oh! Can I square under this table? Square. I'm mashing it. There it is. Nice. Above the fireplace? It's too bad, man. I just stopped smoking yesterday. <gasps> I love you like my dad loves my dad. <sighs> oh. Uh, thanks, Crispy Nuts. And Obamacare, thanks again, and Volcor, and everybody else that likes my stream. Happy Big Friday. I thought I'd keep it fresh. Mierda. See you in Doggy Puppy. Thanks, Sam Fisher. <laughs> Is Sam Thank Fisher you. the guy from that shitty MGS knockoff? <laughs> Thank you. That's not him? Man, what the fuck, dude? This game scares you too much. Hey, that door's open now? Wait a minute, that door was open already. Oh, above the fireplace. Someone said above the fireplace. There it is. Bingo. Bingo? Huh? Whoa. Ah! Wow. See, I told you, you're supposed to die. 
You're not gonna step on my head again? You win when that happens. That's me winning. That means I won. Maybe I'll play that evil game either tonight or tomorrow. You're my favorite streamer, smile, smile. Hey, thanks, everybody. Thanks, huge erection. No, Hugh, whatever. Thanks, Hugh. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, thanks, Cybrus and Gravelord Morrow and everybody else that likes my stream. Hope you guys are all having a great one. Like me. Mm, personally, on my plate, I got <laughs> yeah, Evo. Thank you. I got the rest of Super Nintendo and Sega Genesis. I want to play all that shit. Mm, and what was that game? Streets of Rage 4. I might try it, but I don't know how long it's going to keep me entertained. I like Super Nintendo more than Streets of Rage because... Mm, but hash, Jack you know, Moore, Fox there's a million of them. Smile, smile. Oh, smile, Daymare? Smile. smile. Okay. You think I should try Daymare on PS4? I might retry that. Just play the old Streets of Rage. That's what I'm saying. I could play three different Streets of Rage. You know? Uh, thanks, Cybrus. And thanks, Cal Torak. And smile, smile. Mm, Animal Crossing left a shitty taste in my mouth when those uh, I learned how the turnips work. I really can't stand the way that works, man. You know, when they go, oh, my turnips are at 600 bucks. Come on over and fuck you. Cut you know? Bitch off. Caller. You're my favorite. <laughs> Thank you. Mm, thanks, Twist Eye and Guard Number 7. Just don't, don't do turnips? Yeah, but then I'm already not time traveling, you know? All these assholes got the coolest shit going on, and I'm not time traveling, and now I'm not doing turnips, you know? Fuck. Cheating ass bitches. The whole leaderboards are corrupt on that game. Everyone's a cheater. Time traveling, fucking multiplaying. Season 2 of Turnips will be better. <laughs> One can only Thank hope. You. Those devs wake up. They're so out of touch. Hi. Hey, thanks, Dr. Ayaya. And thanks, Zozan Valsa. Muchos Garcias. Oh, man, this shit is stressful. This is a stressful game, you know that? <laughs> Thank you. New fish tomorrow? Yeah, sure. Mm, yeah, I didn't. You know what else I hate about turnips? The uh, way the game encourages you to check the prices multiple times a day. I hate that feeling. Like, oh, I gotta check my turnip prices. Man, whatever. Are you kidding me? Kidding me? Kidding me? Come on, man. <clears throat> Butt hash. Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. You a boob muncher? <clears throat> yeah. Uh, thanks, Wiener, Wanker, and whatever. Well, look into it. Hey, thanks, Time Enforcement Commission and A-Spec. Thanks, everybody. Yeah, turnips are trash, dude. They're so annoying the way they work. I mean, the rules? So you can buy turnips and then travel forward and check the price of turnips tomorrow? What? What? You can't do that? Yes? No? I mean, even if you don't time travel, the fact that you can invite someone to your island to get your prices, 
That's whack. Strength and numbers buff. Can put turnip prices. Hey, all right, someone shoot that guy. You think I'm gonna read all that bullshit for something I hate? You think I'm gonna read a book about turnips? I don't fucking like turnips. Nice book. How oh, you? <laughs> it's an honest living. These noises can eat a dick. Thanks, Anita C. and me. And thanks, Turnip Farmer. <laughs> All right, I'll give it up. Thanks, Anita. Man, I, I mean, it's new. I hadn't heard that one. It's fresh. You know? I like new things. Uh, thanks, uh, you meet. Oh, God. Turnip Farmer, thanks. Appreciate it. Hey, what are you looking at? Happy Big Friday. Hey, happy Big Friday, everybody. Ooh. Do you remember what the mission was for this part of the game? Maybe I should take a picture of the tree. I wonder if you shake it. Does it do anything? Green marijuana? Where's that other one? Do you remember what the other one was called? Could you aim at that fucking one in the middle? Maybe you can't. Maybe it's a secret. Bloodlust? Oh, there it is. Ah! The next day, you have a big It's the Italian guy. From the day the action, you can almost guarantee that you'll never be asked to cook again. And you can get back to doing what you do best. Now, let's agree to the reaction. Hey, where's that one again? What was it called? Damn, they got knocked over. The next day, you have a big amount to meet. You've just totally broken it down. Nice! You serve it just so like I did. Now remember, your family will... Ah! Fuck! Man, this game's scary. Excuse me. Did you guys read that objective? I didn't read it again. Yeah, it's legal. Don't worry. Go straight for the DVDs. Hey, why can't it let me grab the one I want? What? Nerfed. Little Michael. I'm still not used to the name, but he's starting to grow on me. He's perfect. 
and he looks <laughs> just like you. Thank you. He's got your eyes. <sighs> hey, what was the objective? Excuse me. Square. In the last holiday Square. period, no. most of whopping 95 High. deaths, Square. 60% of those were alcohol related. Maxwell Hume from the Pleasant Falls PD stated that alcohol fueled violence and car wrecks have become a huge problem. How much needless death does there need to be before we curb our vices? If you suffer from addiction, seek help now. Talking to you, chat. It's fine in moderation, but when your addiction affects Addicted the lives to of those that around D. you, it's time to do something about it. And in other news, City Hall was vandalized last night. The graffiti reads, who put her in the witch hell? Being a small town, we don't usually have to deal with vandalism. But this message is very specific. Ah? Uh... It's like a painting. I'm in a painting. Maybe it just hasn't, uh, you know. <laughs> Thank you. It's like the textures haven't loaded yet. That's possible. Maybe the textures didn't load. What do you think? Can't tell. The whistles got woo! 24th March, 1985. Did the textures really it's not like a load? Man out here. At first, I wasn't sure this place is creepy, but last night was simply amazing. Maybe this was a great idea. It just needs a woman's touch. Oh, it's because it's an oil painting. It just looks like a fucking shitty game. Twenty <laughs> third March, nineteen eighty five. He really surprised me this weekend. He blindfolded me and whisked me off in the car. When he took the blindfold off, I saw this horrible little run-down cabin in the woods. He'd purchased this place from an estate sale of a deceased hunter or something. He wants to fix it up so we'll have our own little romantic getaway. Huh? Maggie's staying with the neighbors for the weekend, so I guess I'll make the most of it. Yeah, all right. We'll move the fucking chair so I can uh, get down there. Maybe I got to take a picture of it. Aha! Aha! Damn, he's good. You better hurry. She's Fifth March, nineteen eighty-five. I don't ever want to come back. Nineteen eighty-five. Kinds of strange noises. I was one year I old. Whispering. I think maybe some of the locals don't want us here. I heard something in the basement and had to investigate. Oh my God! It's the slaughterhouse down there. There's some really weird shit going on. I appreciate taxidermy as an art form, but this looks like more than that. I assume this is where I'm supposed to go. Do I crouch? No. I 
think I beat it. She's still talking? The hell? Game's scary. Maybe I should take a break and then come back. January eleventh, nineteen eighty six. We just got back from the hospital. Yeah, whatever. What do you think? Break time? It's almost break time. I mean either that or I'll play for another like fifteen or twenty and then eat dinner. It's up to you. Oh, man, this shit is rough. It is almost dinner time. You're right. That's why I said that. When I said it's up to you, I was totally fucking full of shit. It's never going to be up to you. Um, I'm going to keep playing for a little while. What's this weird shit going on here? Frame rate got real shitty all of a sudden, didn't it? Ah. Oh. Look to see the bride. Shut up. Ah! <laughs> hey, thanks, Phil T. Wiena. And Guru Desu, and thanks Iron Reaver, and I gargle bong water. Appreciate it, guys. <sighs> yeah, excuse me. This game is awesome. I don't know if I would go that far, but it's all right. It's one of those kinds of games that's really scary. There's very little to it outside of that, though, which is fine. I'm enjoying myself. I don't know if I'd go as far as to say awesome. I'm just trying to downplay it because I prefer it if you dislike the game that I'm playing. Yeah, that's more like it. Yeah, that's right. That's the stuff. Give it to me. You hate it. Oh, yes. Man, I was going to take a break, but I think I might play a little longer. You know, now that I think about it. Mm. We must be getting pretty close to 100%ing it. <laughs> Thank you. Hey.
Hey, thanks, M uh, Mondo Savage. Thanks, man. Hado CS. Thanks very much. Happy big uh, Friday, everybody. I'm having a great one. Just like you. Dear Diary, I haven't spoken to Dad in years. This is deep. as much as possible. Yeah, all right. Stupid, scary game. Dear Diary, shut the fuck up. Hey, all right. Thanks, Pay is Inc. That's probably what your diary is saying to you. Thanks, Pay is Inc. Ah! Ah! Stupid bitch. Oh, damn. Nice wheelchair. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, thanks, I eat ass and whoa, SC. Thanks. So you guys think that the Ford vs. Ferrari movie is better than Whiplash? I kind of like uh, watching a movie in the evening, especially these days. Mm, quarantine style. Hell no. Which what? Hell no to what? Whiplash, Ford vs. Ferrari, so Ford vs. Ferrari is way better. Whiplash is way better? Both good? Yeah, I think I'm gonna watch Ford vs. Ferrari. Is that the sound of the elevator? That shit is stuck on B. <laughs> Stairs are Thank closed. <laughs> the hell's wrong you. with this thing? The whistles got woo. Hey, thanks, Stoic. Appreciate it, guys. Why would I go to Twitch jail again? Uh, is it because of that nipple? Come on, man. That nipple was tournament legal. Remember Conan? I did naked backflips with the camera so zoomed in that it was like you were butt munching. Cooch and everything. Naked undercarriage backflips. And I didn't go to Twitch jail for that. Woo. <clears throat> you think one little areoli is gonna, you know... Do anything? <sighs> oh. 
Oh, you don't open doors that way. You just push them open like a saloon. Woo. There ain't shit in here. <sighs> Scary ass stupid game. The game scares you for no reason. And then it scares you for a reason. I think I might have died. You know, I think, I'm starting to think you guys might be right about this game sucking. I'm not sure. But one thing I'll give it is it did a great job of making me not realize it sucks until like a few hours in this game's tight wow <laughs> thank you mostly positive <laughs> his aim's good that's a secondary weapon thanks stoic and thank <laughs> thanks anal beads thank you. and nuka kush thanks mostly positive <clears throat> Alright, listen here. Can we go over uh, what games that I'm excited about right now? I know there's that shark game. I'm liking... Not the fish game, Evo. There's a new shark game coming out. There's a new shark game. Maneater, yeah. I'm going to play that. There's a few scary games coming out in May. They're all garbage, but I'm going to play them. They're probably going to be better than this. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, all of the Nintendo Super Nintendo games that I haven't tried, as well as I'm gonna do some Sega Genesis in the same fashion. 
Yeah. Excuse me. What am I forgetting? Oh, yeah, Streets of Rage. Streets of Rage, it's up in the air. To be honest, whatever. Who gives a shit? But you never know. I, I, I was going to play it, but then I forgot to. Uh, today, I woke up. There was no Streets of Rage in my mind, anywhere to be found. All the way until I streamed. And then when I turned it on, people were like, no Streets of Rage? And I was like, oh, <laughs> shit. You. Well, it turns out I don't give a fuck about that game, you know? I mean, just, I didn't know I don't. But based on what my brain remembered today, I don't. So, you know, it's just, that's just what I'm telling you how it went down. I'm telling you the story. Hmm. It's good, though. Yeah, I know. That's, look, there are a lot of things that are good. That I don't give a fuck about. Those two things are not even closely related. You know. There, In fact I'm glad there are a lot of things that are good. That I don't give a fuck about. Because then you wouldn't have anything to like. What are you going to like? You know what I mean? <laughs>